A Wollongabba man is fighting for his life after being pulled from his burning home. Neighbours tried desperately to save him before fire crews arrived. As Tegan George reports, a faulty fan may have sparked the blaze. Firefighters found 63-year-old Tony McGrath still inside his burning home. Rescue was a priority, so the, the patient was removed first and then the fire was suppressed. He was barely breathing and unconscious. His neighbours had tried to rouse him after they saw smoke coming from the front bedroom. I tried to smash the French doors to get in, but they were locked, and then tried to get in through the side window there, but there was too much smoke and the flames were too big. There was little more they could do. So then I've just come downstairs and tried to stick a hose on the house to keep the flames down as much as I could. Thankfully, the fire was contained to the bedroom of the Woolloongabba home, which was previously owned by the 63-year-old's parents. Seeing the flames and things coming out and all the everyone arriving was pretty full on. Investigators spent the day looking into what caused the blaze. It's believed an electrical fault may have been to blame. They're focusing on a pedestal fan. Firefighters say there was a smoke detector in the house, but it wasn't working. Tegan George, 10 News.